Even though I love looking around DIY stores, it's good to be home. I can do the nice cup of tea now. That's funny. That's delivery man's van in drive, but no sign of delivery man. I wasn't expecting any deliveries today. I bet Aston's making a brew in kitchen. I keep telling her she's far too kind to these lower classes. That's odd. Aston's put snip on front door. I'll have to go around back. Ooh, back door's locked also. Ooh, but there's a window open in bathroom. If only I had a ladder. Oh, hang on a minute, I almost forgot me bionic legs. I can jump up bathroom window, grab onto ledge and climb into house. <laughs> Where we go? At last I'm in house. Aston, it's only me, it's not burglar. Just snip us on front door. Aston, where are you? Oh, what are you doing in bed? Oh, you don't look well, Aston, you're all flushed. Do you want me to call doctors? That's a good idea, Juggy. I'm not feeling very well at all. Can you call doctors right now? From phone, downstairs. Oh, yes, Aston, but just let me get changed first. I had a bit of an accident in DIY store with a masting gun. And a tube of no more nails. I ended up sticking myself to manager who wasn't too happy. I'll just go in wardrobe and get a new pair of jeans and denim shirt. No, doggy no, you can't go in wardrobe. I've got your Christmas present in there. I don't want you to see it. It'll spoil surprise. Oh, it's a bit early for Christmas presents, Aston. It's only flaming March. Look, I'll only be a minute. I'll just open the door a little bit, reach in and grab some clothes. I'm all covered in glue here at the moment. You see, Aston, I'm not peeking, I'm just having a little grope around inside. Oh, I think I may have found my Christmas present, Aston. Is it a bag of marbles? And a sausage? Okay, get your hand down that wardrobe! Aston, you can't keep food in wardrobe, you can't keep sausages with the best denim. I'm gonna have to take it away. Doggy, no, leave it alone! That's funny, it appears to be stuck. I'll have to yank it with the barrack arm. No, um, Mr. Rubble, uh, please stop. Oh, hello, delivery man. What are you doing in wardrobe? And starkers. Oh, it is like this, Mr. Rubble. Uh, I appear to have gotten myself into rather a dilemma. Yes, you can say that again, delivery man. I'm no fool, I can see what's going on here. I don't have to be Hercule Poirot to work this one out. Well, if you would just let me explain the situation, Mr. Rubble. Save your breath, Pillock. I don't need to hear your tissue of lies. I've caught you with smoking gun. It's quite clear to me what's happened. You sneaked into my house and are trying to ransack my wardrobe full of my vintage denim collection. Well, you wasted your time. Those 501s from 1983 were shrink fit in the bath. At the time I thought it was just a fashion, but now it's proven to be a security measure. You'll never fit into them. Uh, no, Mr. Rubble, I insist you have got the wrong end of the stick. Well, I've got flaming wrong end of something, and it's not flaming stick. Uh, would you mind removing your hand from my genitalia? That Wrangler shirt, that's from 1975. And you should have got me dead and insured. Dougie, leave me alone! There's an explanation! I require no explanations, Aston. The delivery man has quite clearly sneaked into our house when you were clearly unwell and has tried to make off with my denim collection. I assure you, Mr. Rubble, that is not the case. Well, he could have fooled me, delivery man. That lowest jean jacket from 1977 is exactly the same as one worn by Bear Reynolds in Smokey and Bandit 2. It's worth a small fortune. This wardrobe is my denim shrine, as you have desecrated it. Okay, I've told you! Leave me alone! I'll explain! There is only one punishment for your crime, delivery man. You go out window. Oh, Mr. Rubble! Okay, no! Put it down. No! Oh. Okay, what you done? You've done it this time, Doggy Rubble. I'll have you know, delivery man was coming up bath with your Christmas present when he tripped on one of your guitars and fell head first into a tin of gloss paint. Ooh, I did leave tin of paint by front door. I had to bring him inside, put his clothes in the washing machine, and send him up for a shower. And then I had one of my migraines coming on, so I had to go to bed. Ooh, but Aston, what was he doing in wardrobe? He was in the shower, Doggy. 
The idea of coming in through bathroom window and panicked and wanted it in wardrobe. Oh, cracky, Aston. I think I got it wrong again. You have got it wrong again, Dougie Rubble. Now go downstairs and fetch my rolling pin. Oh, flaming Nora. Time for another panic runner.